I am here at CES 2019 at the Intel booth with Arthur, who's going to tell me all about what we're standing in front of right now. I have to say, Arthur, I saw Streamlabs, and I saw Intel, and I saw OBS, and I was immediately drawn to this section of the booth. So what is this all about? Live streaming is one of the key categories that we're focusing on. We want to make sure that Intel delivers some great experience for the live streamers. Now, typically for the live streamers, you have to go through a very significant learning experience, try to understand all the technical jargons behind it. One of the things that's really challenging is that there are over 265 parameters that you have to figure it out. So in an effort to reduce the barrier of entry, we've been working very closely with a company called Streamlabs. And so they're widely utilized by companies like Twitch and stuff. In fact, over 40% of the streamers on Twitch uses Streamlabs. So for the last year, we've been working very closely with them to put together an optimum setting of configuration, both hardware and software, a platform that consists of capture card, optimized the setting. So now we want to give you a great out of box experience. For example, the only thing you have to know are three things. You have to turn it on, plug in your HDMI cable mm -hmm. and your audio cable into the streaming PC, and then you figure out what service you want to stream it to. It supports 1080p, 60 frames per second, and give you a great good streaming experience. Yeah, we've seen a lot of these mini streaming PCs here at CES. I know the idea was announced by Intel at TwitchCon this year, and it really does simplify the process. So if you're a streamer who maybe has only been streaming from one PC to simplify the process, but your PC is kicking and screaming because you're trying to run the game and stream at the same time, this is a really simple solution for you. So again, you said that's three steps. Turn it on. Yes. Plug in the HDMI. And your audio cable and your audio cable. And then you have to figure out where you're streaming to. Okay. And you have a variety of different hardware partners that you're working with to make these mini streaming PCs come out. When can we expect to see these available? So we have Acer, Shuttle, Zotec, Simply Nook, and CyberPower, and we're gonna expect more customer coming on board. Today is in a small form factor, and we expect things like all-in-one, notebook, deliver a similar capability. We expect mass production by end of March from those vendors I just mentioned. Excellent, well thank you so much for supporting streamers. Pleasure, let's keep on live streaming here.